And many of you are waking up to a very wet start to this Tuesday. Rain started for many parts in the state last night and continued throughout the evening. Channel 3 Eyewitnesses reporter Marcy Jones is live in Uncasville with the view of uh, I-395. And Marcy, looks pretty wet out there. It definitely is. It's raining cats and dogs. Take a look over here. This is the roadway. But on our way here, guys, unfortunately, within the last few hours, as you heard Caitlin mention, a lot of drivers are finding trouble on the road. Now, it's hard to say specifically what caused those accidents, but I can tell you that the rain definitely is not helping. You know that when the roads are slick, it gets harder to slow down, and you want to make sure that you're giving yourself enough room between you and the other vehicle in front of you. You want to watch that back spray from any of the trucks or really just any vehicles in front of you when people are going even at a relatively slow speed, you can find a lot of water kind of coming up. So some towns like East Hartford have been warning residents about pockets of water, some urban flooding, that kind of thing. It's hard to tell, especially like right now before the sun has come up, what is exactly a shallow puddle and what is a much deeper thing that could cause some hydroplaning. Again, it doesn't take a lot of water to make uh, your tires not have contact with the road. So just be extra careful, plan extra time. And if you ever feel like you're losing control, make sure you pull over in a safe area or if you find yourself in an emergency situation, call 911. Reporting live in Uncasville, Marcy Jones, Channel 3 Eyewitness News. All right, Marcy, that's some good advice there this morning. 6.05.